Alright, hey guys, Josh here from WeFolder.com with another video tour for Endless Ocean 2 on the Wii. Uh, today what we're going to be checking out in the game is the aquarium. If you play the original one, uh, you'll remember that there was an aquarium where you could customize it with all your favorite fish. Well now in the sequel it's a little bit different, it's a little bigger, and so I thought it'd be pretty cool to go on a little mini video tour of it. So, let's jump into it and uh, see what's new in the aquarium in Endless Ocean 2. Alright, so really quickly, just like I have in all the other tours, I'm going to explain the controls. Uh, basically, you point at the screen, you have your little cursor here, you move it to the sides, you can adjust the camera, you know, pretty simple. And now by pressing and holding the B trigger, my character will begin to walk around. So this is actually new. If you played the original game, you had an aquarium, but you couldn't walk around outside of it. You were just inside the aquarium. This is the big aquarium right here that you can customize with all sorts of different fish. If we want to dive into the aquarium, I point at it and press A. Or if I want to just change what's in the aquarium, all you have to do is press the one button. And I can change everything right here. But let's just go ahead and jump into it anyways, and then we'll change it from inside. So, um, you know, every time you encounter a new fish in the game, you have the ability to then put it in your tank. So I have a lot of different fish here already. I'm going to press the one button, and we're going to completely clear out the grid. There we go. And now as you can see, you have, what is that, 16 areas for your grid in terms of what you can put in. Something big like a whale takes up four, then you also have a category down here, these take up two, and then you also have the really small fish which take up only one. So let's just put some fish in there, press OK, it'll load it up real quick, and then we can see all of our fish in the tank almost instantly. There you go. So you can swim around, press B, you know, and you can interact with all the fish by going over and pressing the A button to learn about them. Oh, that guy's getting away. There we go. You can feed them, you can take pictures of them, just like you can in the actual game. So it's pretty cool. You have your own little tank, put all the fish that you like the most in it, and uh, I'm not totally sure if you can uh, go to the tank or go to the aquarium on Wi-Fi because I unfortunately have not been able to uh, find anybody with the game yet because it's only out in Japan. So that's the main big aquarium. Now new to Endless Ocean 2, that was in the first game, but new to Endless Ocean 2, if I come over here to the elevator, we can, uh, we can if I can click on it, we can check out four little tanks. So we have four tanks here. Each one has a different kind of theme to it. So this would be like a tropical tank, sort of your standard tropical fish here. I can move around and check it out. I can click on the fish and feed them just like I can in uh, the big tank. Then you also have a tank which would be, this one I believe is like a deep water tank. All the fish in here would be for, you know, very deep watered fish. Uh, one for the river, one for cold water fish, so it's pretty cool. You have four little tanks. Mine are empty right now because they haven't gotten around to customizing them yet. But that's pretty cool. And then finally, the other thing you can do is uh, place polar bears and penguins and otters in this style tank, which is really pretty crazy. So it's going to load up here real quick. I have some penguins on the ground. They're hopping around. You can feed them. Let's feed the penguin real quick. Pull out some fish and give it a toss. There we go. So yeah, it's pretty cool. This is like a little bonus area in Endless Ocean 2 where you can customize things with all your favorite animals and all your favorite fish. So yeah, just thought it'd be uh, something you guys would want to check out. Uh, to end it, I think we're going to come over here to the otters in the water here and throw them a fish. Alright guys, for WeFolder.com, hope you've enjoyed this little tour. Hope you've enjoyed all of our tours of Endless Ocean 2. It's a great game coming out in 2010 in North America and Europe. So, until next time, I'll see you guys later.